All right, posterior chain today. Welcome back. We are just going to warm ourselves up. Good. Good, we're gonna start wide, wide stands, just warming up. You can actually do barefoot workouts today, just on a yoga mat. Wide stance, wider than shoulder width apart. You can put your hands on your waist. You're just gonna sit into a deep squat. Ideally, if you're with me live, if I can see you, if you can position your camera just so I can see you. Thank you, Belinda, awesome. Get those knees to track over those toes. Pull that belly button to your spine. Squeezing those glutes up top. Find your breath here. Good, you got it. So I love barefoot workouts, especially on today, right? Because you can really work on the proprioception in your feet. We're gonna work on some upper back, some glutes, some hamstring. Good, you're gonna touch those toes. Get a nice stretch in the back of those legs, walking forward. Good, stepping up with one foot, land here. Good, step back, walk back, touch those toes. And then again on the other side, walk forward, step up to the other side, finding your breath here. Step back, walk back, get a nice stretch. Take your time here, we're just priming your body, no need to rush through it. Step back, walk back, touch those toes, and forward. Amazing, step back, walk back. Let's do one more side here, find your breath. Amazing, last side. Good, step back, walk back. Slowly round yourself up. Good, let's do it again. So wide, wide stance. Good toes pointing out. Good knees tracking over those toes. Good, now that you're getting a little oxygen flow, I want you to go a little deeper. Only if your body will allow you, pull that belly into your spine. Ground chest. Nice, good, squeeze those glutes up top, right? Upper body, pretty upright. Nice, for five, squeeze. Four, core tight, three, good, two, one more. Amazing, touch those toes, one more here. So, this time when you step up, I want you to then rotate towards that front leg, nice. Good, hand comes down, step back, walk back. Land here, nice stretch in the back of those legs, forward, other side, open it up. Good, hand floats down, step back. We're gonna do two more sides, you can go your own pace here. Find your breath as you move through it, as best you can. You got it. Amazing, one more side. If you have a smartwatch, don't forget to turn it on, because I always do. It's my friendly reminder to you. Amazing, last one. Very good, slowly round it up. Good, grabbing on to two hand weights, kettlebell, dumbbells, whatever you have around. Good? We are going to start with Paul Sumo Squat. So feet shoulder width apart. So not as wide as where we were. Feet shoulder width apart, good. Your knees are gonna come out. Good, and you're gonna pinch forward slightly. But what we're gonna do is do a half, um, half set here, half rep, sorry. Come all the way down, squeeze up. Good, so core nice and tight. Your feet are a little closer. Your shoulders are basically just in line with those heels, good. Core nice and tight. So I want you to brace, deep breath in, coming down, up halfway, breathe out, all the way down, squeeze here. Nice, yes. Good. Find your breath. So what I want you to feel is that you're using those glutes and hamstrings to get you halfway up. If it is too much on your back, you should never feel this in your back ever. Good, but if it puts too much tension to be down part way and then back down all the way, that I want you to just go up and down. You find what works best for you, right? Find your breath. Hold on. Part way, take your time, right? Not a rush. Up halfway, down all the way, up all the way, squeeze up top. Let's go five more here. Nice, squeeze shoulder blades back and together. Four, yes. Good, three. Nice, 
probably not good. Two, I see you guys. Last one. You should feel this in the glutes. Ooh, mama, good, put it down. Planking, two different options here. We're either tabletop, opposite arm, opposite leg, not allowing any movement in the back, or you're on your hands and feet, opposite arm, opposite leg, pausing, only if this is your wheelhouse, right? Doing either one is great, let's go. Take your time, pause up top, center, core tight, activate butt down. I don't want your butt here, I want it here. Take your time, find your breath, extend, breathe, two more side, hold on. I don't want to see those hips swiveling. You got it, one and one. One, breathing, one. Amazing. Up you get. Again. Let's do it again. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's go, proud chest. Part way. Good, squeeze. Make sure, make every single one count. Squeeze up top, yes. Nice, Linda, you got it. Proud chest, core tight, do not dump into the back at all. Nice, Steven, you got it. Find your breath. Squeeze, drive those toes down. Yes, you got it. Nice, everyone, for 10. Nice, Rach. Nine, I saw you going heavier, Rachel. I like it. Eight. Uh, seven. Proud chest, everyone. Six, keep it tight in the core. For five. Yes, four. Yes, three, I know, I feel it too. You should feel it right in the glutes. Two. Uh, one. We are doing three sets today, ladies and gentlemen. Good, put it down. Planking. I know, 15 is long. 15 is long, but 15 is good. Ready? Find your plank on your tabletop. Activate that core, you don't want to be seen swiveling. Good, nice and controlled. Lift one, opposite arm, opposite leg, pause there. Back to center, opposite arm, opposite leg. Back to center. So what, I, what I'm saying when you don't swivel, you want to activate brace through that core so you can extend those arms and legs and not have to shift your weight. Good? Stay with me. Find your breath. Take your time. Three more side. Bum down, Belinda. Good, if you have to hike those hips, go back to bird dog, right? Go back to here and squeeze that glute. Extend that arm as best you can. Good? Just because one is more challenging than the other doesn't mean you get more just by doing the more advanced one. Good, relax, up you get. I'd rather you do it properly than try to push through the more advanced version because then you don't get what you need to get out of it, okay? Ready, one last one. Do you need to go heavier in weight here? Ask yourself, do you need to pick up something heavier? Good? Same stance, core tight. Squeeze those glutes up, time, up top, make every single one work. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Open up all the way, double dip. Control, good, this is not a ballet move. This is really engaging, disengaging. Time under tension, overloading those glutes. Proud chest, nice. Go down all the way up, halfway, all the way down, all the way up. Good. For 10. Notice how I go all the way down, halfway up, all the way back down, and up. I want you to be there. Core tight. Seven. Six. Keep it tight. Yes. For five. Four. Hold on. Nice. Nice calf, three. Don't pinch forward, two, proud chest. Ugh, one. Ugh. Put it down, put it down. 
Last one of these, everyone. Make it as good as you can. Okay, we're going to do eight a side this time. You do your pace. Take your time. I want you to pause one, two, up top of wherever you are. Good? Find it. One, two, slow. Other side. One, two, other side. Breathe. One, two, other side. Core tight. Yes, it should be challenging. Take your time. Tummy, 
Good, toes grounded down, squeeze those glutes, fire up those glutes, tuck that chin, arms to the side. You're gonna lift those arms to a T for four seconds. We're gonna lift it to a Y for four seconds. Good, you're gonna lift right above your head for four seconds, and then you're bringing your thumbs up 90 degrees, good? So T, Y, thumbs up, I to 90, okay? So all the while squeezing shoulder blades back in together. Fire on that core, glutes on. So you should not feel it in your lower back at all. Ready? Three, two, one. Good. For a T. Three, two, one. Reach up to Y. Three, two, one. To an I. Three, two, one. Find your nice 90 degree bend. For three, two, good. Relax down for one second. We're going to do it again three more times. Let me just rotate this and that. Good, ready? Arms out to the side, squeeze those glutes, lift that chest off for four, three, two, one. Squeeze shoulder blades like you mean it. Four, two, Y, three, two, one. Above your head to an I. Three, two, one, 90 degrees for four. Three, two, one. Very good, relax for a second. Two more of these in three, two, one, and to Y, lift that chest off the ground, squeeze shoulder blades back in together, tuck that chin, arms to Y for four, breathe, squeeze those glutes, two, one, arms to Y, three, two, one, arms 90 degrees, hold it, squeeze, lift higher, two, one, relax down, one last one, I want you guys all to get your chest off the ground, do not dump into the lower back, in three, two, one, arms to the side, for three, two, one, arms up, four, three, two, one, all the way up, four, three, two, one, 90, four, three, two, amazing, up you get everyone. Very, very good. Good, grab those hand weights again. Side lunge, two curtsy. This time we're gonna add in a bit, a bit, a bit of a bonus. I can't even talk, all the blood has drained from my brain. Side lunge, regular side lunge. We're gonna double dip the curtsy. Good, so I want it to be intentional. Extend, back down, then to your side lunge. Good, we're gonna get into those glutes, squeeze those inner thighs. I know you like that inner thigh bonus, okay? That's for you, Rachel. I know you like those inner thigh workouts hard. Yay, okay. Ready, grab those weights, or no weights, whatever works for you in three, two, one. Side lunge, good. Curtsy, curtsy. Take your time, side lunge. Proud chest, curtsy, curtsy. We're going for 12 a side this time. Yes, we are going more than before, but I have faith in you. Let's do it. Proud chest, hold on. Proud chest, Ugh. yes you can. For seven, curtsy, curtsy, six, Nice, Steven. Get deeper, guys. If you have no weights, challenge yourself. Nice range of motion. If you have weights, challenge yourself still. Four. Nice. Three. Yes, Steven. I like it. Two. One. One. Oh my God. Huh. Ready? We're gonna go to the other side, five seconds. Four, three, two, let's go. Other side for 12. Double curtsy, don't forget it. Make it good. Proud chest. Yes, everyone, for 10. Nice, nine. Nice, Belinda. Keep it tight, everyone. Eight, find your breath. Seven, I'm here with you. Six, yes, for five, four, you got it, three, yes, two, one, Holy moly. Woo, put it down. For one second. Good, if you need to 
you, you're gonna grab those weights. We're doing one arm and the other. So, option one, holding that contraction one side and the other. Option two, extending, sorry, I should have said this way, one side and the other, right? So you find what works best for you. If you have the strength already to hold those weights up, then do that. You can toggle in between, start with contraction and then go back. Find what works for you, ready? Grab those weights, I'm gonna grab something a little heavier for me. Let's do it together, ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Hinge, squeeze, one side and the other. One side and the other, stay with me. Pull that belly button to your spine, you should not feel this in the back, bend those knees a little more, Belinda. Yes, you got it, for seven. Good, don't get mad. Six, stay with me if you can. For five, core tight. Four, uh, three, two, one and one. One and one. Oh my God, very good. Put it down. All right, on your bellies, everyone. On your bellies. So in this position, when you're here, I want you to pull those shoulders off the ground, right? And you're not hyperextending and dumping into the back. You're taking from here, opening up that chest, squeeze shoulder blades back in together. Good, keep those ribs tucked, do not just flare. Good, let's do it. <sighs> Toes ground down into the ground, squeeze those glutes, tuck that chin, arms to the side. Lift up for four, three, two, one, two wide for four. Squeeze those glutes, three, two, one. Lift high for I, three, two, one, arms to the side for four, three, two, one, good, relax for a second, four, three, two, lifting up for four, palms down, two, one, two, Y for four, three, squeeze, two, one, two, and I for four, three, two, one, 90 degrees, lift, squeeze, two, one, relax down for four, three, two, one, we've got two more here. Lift up, squeeze, four, three, two, one. Arms to a Y, thumbs up, two, one. Arms to an I, thumbs up, three, two, one. Last one, 90 degrees, two, one. Relax down, going into that last one. In three, two, one. Last one, everyone, squeeze up, four, three, two, one. To a Y, four, three, two, one. One, I, four, reach, good, 90 degrees, four, three, two, yes, relax. Ooh, mama, take a quick sip if you'd like. We are doing a final round of our lunge curtsy. I know, I know, we're gonna do it together. So you can do no weights in this last round. We are going to do 15 reps. We are still doing the double dip curtsy. I'm gonna put my weighted vest on. I wanna see impeccable form, core nice and tight. All right. Very good, everyone. Good. So if you haven't switched sides with whatever leading leg you started with, I'd like you to switch for this one. So if you start with right, the last one, and the one before, do left side. If you've been alternating, you can alternate again. Good, let's go, 15 aside. And if you start with weights, you can always end without weights. There's always that option, ready? I want you to go as deep as you can. In three, two, one, good, side lunge. Curtsy, double dip, core tight, double dip. Good, side lunge, curtsy, double dip. Nice, proud chest, side lunge. Keep it tight, curtsy, double dip. Find your breath, curtsy, Woo, double dip. Try not to fall. Oh, good, side lunge. You got it, squeeze those inner thighs, get deep here, butt back. Good, back knee close to the ground. I know, we're doing 15, sorry, I did not mention that. Don't get mad, we got eight more, eight more. I know, I'm here with you. You can put those weights down if you need to. Seven, nice Paulina. Nice calf, oh my God. Six, you should feel this in the glutes. Five. Uh, four, uh, three, three, two, one. 
Oh my god. One. Oh. <laughs> Holy moly. You should feel that right in the glutes, yes? Oh. We're gonna go to the other side. Ready? In three, two, one. Side lunge. Curtsy, curtsy. Proud chest. Keep it tight. Take your time. Make it good. Yes, yeah, squeeze those inner thighs. Do not underestimate the slow and control. This is where muscle building happens. This is where the fat burning happens. You got it, my friends. For 10. Oh my God. Stay with me. Nine. Proud chest. Eight. Yes. Seven. Don't go far. We're gonna do one final set of those rows. So check in, do you, can you do heavier weight? Do you need something different than you did before? Good, this is our last set, uh, set uh, last round of this set, and then we're going into something different right after this, okay? Good, grab those weights, stand tall. Good, hinge forward. Good, let's go. We're gonna do 12 aside. Proud chest, pull that belly button to your spine. You should not feel this in the lower back. For nine, take your time. Don't swing, eight. To the lower rib, seven, six. Steven, turn sideways for me. For five, thank you. Four, good. Tuck that chin, three. Yes, two, two, one, and one. Yes, put it down. Very, very good, everyone. Take a quick, quick sip. Don't go far because we're going to go into some single leg deadlifts. Single leg deadlifts, then an extra bonus glute focus. I don't know about you, but I'm never good. Good. So you have the option. <laughs> Thank you. You have the option to do weights or no weights, okay? I'm going to use my weighted vest just for my balance. So we're going to do single leg deadlift, and I encourage you to do it with one leg floating up, good? So it's going to look like this. Bend in that standing leg, hinging forward, nice stretch in this leg. So if you need a wall beside you, if you need a chair beside you to help you with balance, then do that, okay? I would rather you try to float that leg up, keeping that hip square, meaning you're not letting that leg open, right? Keeping those hips square as you hinge forward, good? Hips even, ready? Five seconds. Four, three, two, nice lunge up, hinge forward. Take your time, nice stretch. Come up, squeeze. Good, bring that chair closer to you, Belinda. I want it almost like right here, so like literally if you're losing balance, you can tap it with your fingertips. Better, good, proud chest. You guys can't see it, but I'm using the wall if I need it, just so you know. Take your time, really encourage that hip. Good, nice stretch. You don't have to go down. I want you to go as deep as you get a nice stretch in the back of that leg. Squeeze that glute up top. Nice, Steven. You got it. Six. Squeeze. Five. Four. Feel it. Hold on. Proud chest, core tight. You should not feel this in the back. Three. Oh my goodness. Two. Last one, last one. One. Oh my God. Woo! Other side, you ready? Same feeling, nice stretch, squeeze that glute up top, not leaning back into it, activate, squeeze, ready? Slight bend, three, two, one, let's go, hinge. Take your time. Yes, one side the balance will be better than the other, but that's okay. Bring that focus, that determination, woo! Oh my God. Take your time. Controlled on the way up. Use that chair, that wall, whatever it is. Hold on. 
for seven. You got it. Oh my god. Six. Yes. Oh my god. For five. My balance is bad on this side. That's okay. Four. You do your best. Three. Yes. Two. One. One. O M G. You should feel that hamstring and glute. Don't go far. We're going right to the other side. Okay. Five seconds. Four. Three. Core tight. Two. Find that balance. One. Let's go. Nice stretch in the back of that leg. Come up. Squeeze. Make every single one count. We're doing 15 this side. Don't get mad, I know. I'm right here with you. Take your time. Make every single one count, guys. Right? Slow it down on the way down. Slow it down, excuse me, on the way up. Feel that nice stretch for 10. Proud chest. Nine. Eight. Belinda, do glute bridges if this is bothering your back. Lie down on your back, heels close to your backside, drive those hips up and down. And if you don't, don't want to do that, you can grab your red band, whatever it is, for five. Woo, four more. Take your time. Three. So heels on the floor, Belinda, feet on the floor. And hips up and down. If it feels okay. Yeah, glutes, there you go. One. Oh my God. Other side. Other side. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. We've got 15. Take your time. This side for me is always harder.
Six, nice, Rach, good. For five, take your time. Four, yes, Stephen, good. Three, oh my God, two, one. Oh. Woo. You should feel that in the ass, my friends, good. Other side, so tabletop. Hand, left hand down, right forearm down. Oh my God, are you ready? We're going the other side. Lift that leg up. Left knee to left shoulder, kick it back. Left knee to left shoulder, kick it back. Good, nice. Really good, everyone. I know. Keep that knee high as it comes across for 10. Breathing. Nine. Eight. Oh my God, seven. Six. For five. Four, hold on. Three. Two. One, good, keep that leg up. Oh my goodness, or bring it down for a second, then bring it back up. <laughs> Ready? Extend, bend. Out to the side, guys, so like you're kicking right to the side. Squeeze, I mean, the focus is squeezing this heel to your backside. For seven, six, hold on, oh my God, five, four, oh my God, three, two, one, good. Fire hydrants. Last one, my friends. Let's go. Up and down. Yes. For 10. Down control. Don't swing it. Nine. Breathing. Eight. Seven. Six. For five. Core tight. Four. Three. Oh my God. Two. One. <laughs> Don't get mad. We're doing one more side. Flip over. We're gonna make it shorter. 10 kickbacks, 10 uh, fire hydrants. Ready, leg up for 10, nine, come with me, we're almost done. Eight, three, seven, press, six, core, five, four, we're gonna go right into the fire hydrants if you can. Three, two, one, good, knee to the side for 10, nine, breathe through it, eight, seven, Yes, you can. Six. Hold on. Five. Come back to me. Four. Uh, three. Two. One. <laughs> I hope you're feeling that with me, my friends. Holy. Ready? Other side. Let's go for ten. I know. Nine. Because this hudge had to stabilize the other side, you might be feeling this right away like I am. Six, core tight, no body flailing. Five, four, three, two, yes you can. One, I know mine feels like it's gonna cramp. Ready? For 10, fire hardens. Nine, three, eight, hold on. Seven, six, yes, five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Backside, please. Leaning back. You're gonna just rock those hips side to side. You should be landing right on that piriformis, that glute where we all were working really hard on just now. Good. Bringing one leg in. Oh my gosh. Figure four. Sitting up, bringing your chest as close to there as possible. You're gonna feel that stretch. Be gentle if it's super duper 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 tight. Good, and rock side to side just slightly. Good, bring the sole of the foot down to the mat, proud chest. Squeeze that leg into your chest. Amazing, other side. Oh my goodness. You, so you should feel that right in that piriformis, that glute where we just worked on. Good, rocking side to side slightly. Amazing, taking that foot that's closest to you, bring it down, figure four, giving that front leg a really good squeeze. You should feel it move down a little deeper. Woo! Very good, everyone. Good, straightening out those legs in front of you. Hinging forward, get a nice stretch from the back of those. Hamstring, sorry, I moved really close to the mic. Might have got really loud for you for a second. <laughs> Good, 
crossing one leg over the other. Rotate over that leg. And the other side. Good, when you're ready, stand it up, please. Grabbing onto those laces, even though it wasn't quad focus, we still need to love on the front of those legs. Bring that heel to your backside, bring those knees together if you can. Get a nice stretch in the front of that leg. Amazing, other side. Amazing, feet together, deep breath in, arms above your head, leaning to one side, leaning to the other. Good, round forward, open up those lats. Deep breath in, arms above your head, breathing out, holding forward, hang out here for a moment. And when you're ready, slowly round yourself up. Very good, everyone.